think back to when Art McNally called me. Who, Art was the supervisor of officials at the time. He called me from a meeting they were having in, I think it was Maui, asked me if I was still interested in the job. And of course, I, I jumped right at it. You gotta realize, being a referee is the easiest job in the league, if you believe it or not. As a field judge, I was 25 yards deep downfield. Nobody was supposed to get behind me. And back during that time, you think about keeping up with guys like Willie Galt and Ron Brown. I was exhausted after the game was over with. Well, now, moving to referee, all I had to do was keep he up. starts normally Wednesday night, and I'm preparing for the meeting for the upcoming week, it's really getting to the rule book, mechanics. I think about things I did wrong the previous week. Where we, at work with Bell Atlantic, it's an ongoing thing every day. I'm there eight hours, nine hours a day. So you get used to it. Let's put it this way. In 17 years, I haven't gotten emotional about it, and I haven't gotten nervous about it, but it, it can happen. And some guys, it affects them that way. Me being the leader of the crew, I can't do, do that because I'm sure my guys would pick up on the same thing, and I don't want them to feel that way. I want them to take, to use an old cliche, one game at a time. We make an attempt to communicate with the players. We don't take this holier-than-thou attitude. And uh, if you, in any of my games, you'll see my guys talking back and forth to the players. If something happens on the field, we try to explain to them, especially if it's something that's unusual. I think the goal for every official in the uh, NFL is to someday work a Super Bowl. Because, again, it's, it should mean that for that year, you're rated number one at your position. And that's what we all strive for, being number one. Players, officials, everybody.